If both teams are going to thank God, what happens to the team that loses? Hey, brother. Um, you've asked a lot of questions. And then what if this and then what if that? I will do the best I can to address all of it within this one video. Um, you asked, do uh, does the other team go ahead and thank God, even though they're not on camera, for the loss and see what they can get out of it? Um, they could. Uh, you, you are asserting a question in which uh, the, the question demands that everyone acts the same way. Um, every person is different, so the answer would be different per person. Um, and then uh, if you want to go off a of base per team, depends on how the team works as a unit. Um, ideally, it would be great uh, to show gratitude. Uh, I did not win today's game, but he kept us all safe. No one was hurt during the game. What can I learn about this? Well, let me review the videos see where I could have stepped up my game a little bit better. Let me see where, where where some weak points are that I can work on. And, you know, I thank the Lord that I get to play another game and to work on it to get better. That would be ideally. Do they do that? Who knows? Uh, I have done it in the past, and I have not done it in the past when I used to play sports. Um, and then those who are thanking God on camera, they could be sincere about it and truly wanting to thank the Lord and show true gratitude that not only did he keep them safe and they had a fun time and was able to enjoy uh, the creation around them and the ability to play a sport while doing so and uh, on top of that they get to win or they could just be doing it for you know like actors do just for the glamour and it's just tradition to do so whether they really practice or believe in God at all um, again depends per person um, so also does God choose a winner I don't believe so, and I don't believe there's any enough scripture to even point to where it, it, it would you could argue a good case that he does. Uh, just for mere fact of free will, free will, we get to choose in our reactions, or uh, we have actions, reactions, and then the effects of those actions and reactions. Uh, I think key important things to make sure that God's a, a eternal plan. And how everything works out, he does make sure things follow that footsteps. But little things like, do I have a ham sandwich or a turkey sandwich today? Uh, I don't think God, you know, chooses which sandwich we have. I think he gives us the ability to make such minute choices that have little to no effect on anything on the major outcome. Winning sports, I really do not think uh, have a major outcome on the eternal uh, scheme of plan that God has. Um... But uh, I don't think God just picks a winner and the, deal, and the loser just deals with it. I don't think that's how that works, personally.